Selling your clothes online, it's a good thing because you don't use it, right? It's just in your closet or any other item that you don't use lying around at your house. Just sell it. You have multiple platforms in order to do that. And today I'll show you one which is, in my opinion, the best one. It's called Vinted.com. And Vinted.com works like this. First of all, it is free to list an item. I just love this because you can download the free Vinted app. It is available on the App Store and on Google Play as well. And you can see it's a pretty, pretty popular platform. The rating is also good, 4.6 out of 5. And on the App Store, it's even better, 4.8 out of 5. So people use it. And as you can see, you can just download the app. You don't have to pay any fee for uploading. You just put your item, you take some photos of it, you like write a few things about it, you set your price, and you're ready to go. Then when someone decides to purchase your item, you will have to ship it. And then, of course, you get the money for it. Now, the reason why this is free for sellers is because buyers pay the fees, right? So the app is free, but they do have to pay. Let me just show you how much. So the cost is 5% of the item price plus 70%. All right. So that's what buyers are paying. And it's a good thing for sellers. For buyers, it's not so good. But the clothes are not that expensive. And you can see that from the prices. I'll show you later what else can you get here and what kind of categories can you get. But what people ask me a lot is what kind of like, where do I have to live in order to use this? So it's here. If your country is on this list, you can do it. If it's not, well, you can't do it. The most important for us is the UK and the USA, right? And Canada, of course. How can I forget Canada? So there are a lot of things, you know, and if you scroll, you will see like these like these funny items, you know, like Betty Boo watch and then, then there's like pet care products. There's like aquariums. There's like things for birds. As you can see, these pendants, these, you know, AirPod, as you can see, these are AirPods. So you can sell a lot of things from around your house that you don't use anymore. And I'm sure that every person on this planet has a lot of these things that they just see laying around and they just collect dust or something, you know, and this is a perfect place to get rid of it. And as you can see, people are using this. The traffic on this website is really, really good. And it's all because of the marketing and they have two reasons. The first reason is of course this, this is the most obvious one. So it's better for our wallets, right? And I don't get people that buy new clouds today, right? Because that's just a waste of money. And the second reason is this one, better for the climate. Now, I don't care if you care for the climate or not, but this is popular, all right? This sentence alone is popular and a lot of people are looking to better this, right? So that's why this website is popular because they base their marketing around that. And it is true. So what do you want to do? First of all, you want to create yourself an account and then just head over here to this button, which is entitled sell now. Now, when you click on it, you will be redirected to this page. And it's pretty simple. I like this page because it is just straightforward. It is user friendly and there's not a lot of hoops that you got to jump through, right? So you can add up to 20 photos of your items. And there are some photo tips that, well, you should use these. First of all, take photos in a well-lit area, right? That goes without saying. Second of all, pick a neutral background. I see a lot of these things that are like just cluttered, just like this right picture here. Just make something like this, all right? The reason is it increases your visibility, okay? This is social media platform after all, and there's a feed and people just scroll through it. I'm showing you the desktop version, but if you take the mobile app, you'll see what I mean. So people scroll, right? And you do want to be a scroll stopper, right? Just like on TikTok or Instagram or something like that. You want a bright picture with a neutral background for people to stop and have a look into it, right? Just You just want them to click on your link. Later on, they will see the description and some more photos. But that first one should be a scroll stopper, all right? 
So it's not hard to like follow these instructions. So yeah, follow them. After that, you shouldn't use flash because it does some weird things to colors. I don't know how, but I think that a lot of people were like unsatisfied. So the color of my jeans, let's say, was not like in the pictures, right? So yeah, follow this one as well. Show off your item. Labels, signs of wear, defects, you have to show these because people are going to leave you a bad review if you give them something that you haven't specified before. All right. So yeah, do that. Use your own images as the last one, but I think that everybody knows that. Why should you use something else? And then when you do that with the photos, just head over to the title. Give it a title. For example, as you can see, you've got examples for each one of these faces. So white sweater, only worn a few times. Just write something that you think that person that's purchasing should know. Category, as you can see the categories, you've got a lot of these from pet care, some fish items, decorations, you know, entertainment things, clothes, of course, video games, music and video games and puzzles, you know, there's a lot of these things. So I invite you to explore and I invite you to have a look around your house, right? There's most certainly a lot of things that fall into these categories that you can sell, right? Just get rid of them. I mean, I know it. There's like, Every person on this planet has some things that they don't use and they don't need them. So why should you keep them around? Just sell them. There's people who need that and you can make money on it. So that's it for the upload section. That's all that you have to do. Now, the first tip that I have to give you today, you see, people can like your items. They can like it. All right. There's a heart icon here. So when they like an item, I recommend that you contact those people. All right. So someone will eventually like the item and they will just keep scrolling. But what can you do? Well, you can contact that person because you can see who actually liked your item. So you can see who put that like. So you can offer them a discount. You can say, hello, I saw that you liked your item. Can I offer you a discount on this item? Right. And most people are going to fall for that. And most people are, you know, people are going to be people. They just love to bargain and they will expect to get a good deal out of it. So make them a good deal. Depends on whether you just want to sell it fast or not. The second thing that I got to show you is these item bumps. All right. First of all, item bump happens every time when you make a change to your item. Now they have a paid feature, which is called item bump as well. And you can use these for your items. What happens is that when you bump an item, it's displayed higher in members news feeds and search results for either three or seven consecutive days or until the item is sold, whichever comes first. So this allows you for your item to receive more visibility. As I've told you, the second is to reach the right members. And the third is that you can track this, but this is just a way for Vinted to get the money from you as well. So lower the prices, just do that. Honestly, you don't need these item bumps. If you lower the price, you will get a small bump and people will hook onto it, right? Just be honest with yourself. If you want to sell an item fast, just lower the price down, right? And if you have a lot of things around your house, lower the price even more, just lower it. It's going to get a bump and people are going to purchase it. There's also this, which I, well, if you're just beginning with this, I don't recommend that you use it, but it's called closet spotlight. This is a paid feature that can boost your whole closet's visibility and help you with more chances to sell. That's what they say, but they just want to get your money, right? So be careful with that. If you see that people are liking your items, as I've told you, reach out to those people, reach out to them. It's just that one little call to action that people need from you, from the item owner. You so you just say them, you know, can I offer you a 10% discount on this? Usually people are going to say yes and thank you, right? So yeah, do that. People are going to like your items, offer them a discount. And yeah, learn from other people. Go and see what they sell, how they sell it, what kind of pictures they use, what kind of prices they have. As you can see, all these things you got to have 
in your own items as well. So just see and learn from other people. After all, these people are here before you. So they do know more than you do. So just go and see what they do and replicate the thing. All right. So that's about it. Vinted.com. Sell your items. You don't need them. Wish you good luck.